and it's been paused since the 1st of January and I have all these facilities. So everything is in amazing shape. So here's the receptionist. Two GP offices. Constantly manned. So. As long as I have competent people inside, I probably shouldn't have problems. I mean, needing a third GP office is something to be avoided, but if I need to get one, I can just move the cardiogram somewhere else, like over here. Although I guess I wanted to get the blood machine over here. I already have the scanner, I will need the ultra scan to... Mm, need to fit it someplace. But that's not the biggest of my concerns, definitely. I mean, I can fit these facilities someplace. I can even fit them around here if need be. I don't need additional space. I most certainly do not need all the space I am provided with. Since I have so many plots to potentially get, if I so choose to, if I really, really so desire, which I do not. Right, so here are the clinics, the slack tongue clinic, the fracture clinic, inflation clinic, health restoration clinic as the pharmacy. Here's the research department with no researchers can do researching anything and here's my glorious staff room. So let's slow everything down and see how things are going. Doctor a doctor here, a surgeon here, I, have to, I don't have consultants there, but okay. How are the queues? Oh, they don't really exist, so that's a good sign. I need researchers researching stuff. This guy is a surgeon on his way to a scanner, I might as well place him there. Although I prefer other people to take care of such matters. Do I even have enough staff? I mean, people are resting, so that explains some of the problems I'm having, but still. Of course, the only people I can recruit now are absurdly incompetent. How's my progress, anyway? I have ways to go. So getting a training room and check the graphs, I guess. As long as I can afford it, I might actually start training people. Yeah, I probably can afford it. So I would need a training room someplace. Perhaps around here. Might just be able to squeeze it in. It's cheap. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. We'll create a very narrow corridor around here, but I don't really care since I will be moving people in and out of this place manually, most likely. Although the way this looks is just horrible. People will be getting stuck constantly, but whatever. <clears throat> Bookcases, skeletons, a few lecture chairs, two radiators, perhaps a plant in the bin, I don't need an extinguisher around here. A projector. Single radiator should suffice, I guess. Another bookcase would be nice. Do I need two skeletons? <laughs> Do I even need a second bookcase? Better point, does it even open anything? Do I need a plant? I can't really fit it in here, so let's, let's not put it. I mean, I could theoretically just <clears throat> make this room a little bit bigger. But no. So, if I want to train people, <clears throat> I'm going to need a consultant. I also want to train people. Uh, I mean, specializations 
also matter quite a bit. I would love to train a, another surgeon, but that almost never happens because you need a consultant surgeon to accomplish that. Or a junior surgeon, or a doctor surgeon. Doctor required in GP's office. Getting trained by a consultant to become more competent, which is not my point. I want to teach someone to become a surgeon who is not a surgeon already. Uh. So I could just take this guy. Put him over here with a consultant. So, who are my consultants exactly? This guy's a consultant. But he's in the staff room, I shouldn't tax him too much. Ah, uh, this guy is also fairly tired. I mean, I'm in no rush. I don't necessarily need to start the training right this moment, but I would love to have it ongoing. Only 10 doctors, that's... Doctor required in X-ray. Ambitious. Might as well get some more people. <clears throat> Am I in debt? No, I'm not. Doctor required in GP's office. Can I build some more facilities? Ah, yes, of course, I can get the blood machine. And the decontamination chamber. <laughs> chamber, room, whatever. Seems like a decent place for the blood machine. Uh, I don't think I have one already. I don't. Okay, that's great. So let's get yet another diagnostics facility. I just want to take care of my research because otherwise this might be... A quite upsetting affair. <clears throat> If I simply lose the level because too many people die because my medicine was not up to snuff. I need to work on that. I'm mostly focusing on cure equipment for whatever reason. I remember there being a reason for this. But I also need to focus on drug research quite a bit. I mean, diagnostics equipment could also use some tender love and care. I have the room for all the things. Consultant, researcher, psychiatrist. This guy needs to teach these people a lesson. Or two. Or ten. What are the policies? They can leave rooms and... 60% uh, seems nice. How many nurses do I have anyway? Two nurses, that's... Not enough for now. Let's get a third nurse. <clears throat> so one can be in the staff room, one in the ward, and one at the pharmacy. At the very least, these are not the only places I need them. Oh. Can't help this guy. Not yet. I need the electrolysis machine. I should probably focus all of my research on cure equipment because otherwise... Oh yeah, I can see where this is going. Yeah, does this remind you of anything? Yeah, that was exactly my thought process back then. What am I supposed to do with the guy? What am I supposed to do? I mean, I should probably... Uh, I think I've made a mistake. I should probably just get my consultant researcher over here so he can research things along with the other researchers. Take this consultant out, put this doctor in, take this consultant once again, put him here to teach people absolutely nothing. To just increase their competence, but without giving their specialization. That's unfortunate. Get him to wait. Screw it. Five people with sweaty palms. I think I can handle the emergency. Let's at least give it a bash. 
give it a whirl. If I fail, well, that's just too bad. Okay, how are my psychiatrists doing? This is a junior, so he probably shouldn't be handling this stuff. I need this guy, the researcher, the expert. On the flip side, he will be able to take care of matters quite quickly, so... Come on, let me grab ya. Slow bastard. Patients, please keep your germs to yourself. Nurse required in ward. The poor guy is just waiting. Nurse required in fracture clinic, please. You should probably go home. I mean, the Staff other... announcement. Incoming patients with sweaty palms. Doctor required in blood machine room. As long as this guy doesn't move out, we'll be fine. The bookcase should have probably been closer to the chair. We could just go, chair, bookcase, chair. We should probably move this here and then replace this. Okay, dude, take care of it. Everyone get in here. Blah, blah, blah. Get the hell out. Hold it, they don't need to change. That's a bonus. Now I'm only taking care of this, focusing on this exclusively, which I probably shouldn't. Probably should pay attention to everything around here. Ah, poor guy. I would love to help him, but I just can't. Wrong button. Ooh! People are so happy. And they are definitely not thirsty. How's research going? Not quite fast enough. Go, 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 next person. This guy is sitting so far away, it's my thing. Wait a minute, I should probably move him. Oh, he's next in line. Go, go, buddy. We can help all of you. I'm getting so much money, I should probably pay attention to how my machines are doing. Doctor, attend immediately in cardio, please. Excellent, is that it? I think that's it. So I need to move this guy. Uh, have him help with the research, even though he should be helping with the education of these fine young gentlemen who are trying to... Be more competent than they currently are. So unfortunate that I need this guy for pretty much everything. He's a consultant, a researcher, and a psychiatrist. Pretty much the best guy I have. And now this will keep ticking, even though everything has been taken care of already. Come on, I don't need the diagnostics equipment as much as I need the cure equipment. Just why, why is there even progress being made if it's at 0%? Why? Just focus on this. They're discovering things by accident, aren't they? Yes, the electrolyzer has been researched. Oh, what am I doing? The doll placement, not uh, optimal. Not 
damn it. Fine, this this is the way it should be. There we go. Now I can focus my research on other areas. Oh, it has been all done. So I can focus some of our research on diagnostics equipment, although it has probably already been taken care of. I mean, I just need one more machine as far as I can tell. <laughs> God damn you. Fine, I will take care of the epidemic. Discrete itching. If I fail to contain this, I'll be... Oh, hello there! Nice of you to join um, me. By the way, I will take the risk here, even though it's probably unwise. Taking the hit of 15,000 is something I can absolutely afford. 30,000 and a reputation hit? Suboptimal. Let's try this anyway. The worst thing is that you have to memorize all of these diseases. You have to keep in mind which is treated well, because otherwise... You'll just be left clueless as to where you are supposed to take care of these patients and whether you have the facilities to actually prevent the disease from spreading. Also, the chat isn't visible in on the stream. Hold on, I need to fix that, I guess. that this has been taken care of, I can probably put this consultant here, use this consultant to teach these guys all the skills they could possibly ever need and want. I mean, this guy, if I ever get to train him fully, will become both a surgeon, or will become a surgeon, a psychiatrist, and a researcher. And he will be able to teach the future generations, if it ever gets to that. So many surgeons, and yet they are wandering around. Yeah, let's take care of discrete itching discreetly. I mean, this can be taken care of as long as the nurses nurse in, nurse in, the, in, in the goddamn pharmacy. Otherwise, this will not help much. Should be taken care of quite easily. Either way, what do I need? There's one more diagnostics. Um, well, they've been exposed to so many horrible things in their lives, they probably are to a certain extent immune. Although in the real world it's also one of the in interesting things, because people get so paranoid of, um, of all sorts of infectious diseases, and they go to the doctor scared and tell them there's, there's this horrible thing that people are sick with, and I need to get help with this, and the doctor could just tell them, you know what, do you have any idea how many people have come here with the exact same thing? And do you know what odds are that I have been exposed to this?
And yet the doctor somehow managed to stay alive and not constantly be sick with everything. Because apparently even if diseases are infectious, they are not that infectious. One more person to take care of this. Screw it, I don't need the diagnostics to be complete, just send her to the pharmacy. And let's fix her up. As far as I can tell, we'll be done with the epidemic as soon as she's cured. What? Oh no! Serious radiation! I need to take out a loan. This is a rare occurrence nowadays. I usually don't do this sort of thing. And I guess at the end of the year, if I still have a problem with this, I will be selling the decontamination chamber. Because it's rarely used costs a lot, and it pisses me off just by existing. Well, obviously, as opposed to mild radiation, radiation is a fairly normal thing. There are all sorts of ways to get radiated without being seriously radiated. Doctor required in decontamination. I mean, hell, heat is radiation. taken care of the epidemic. Fully. And there's training going on, so people are getting educated. To the Doctor, attend immediately in cardio, please. Epidemic now under control. <laughs> they have compensated me for the lies about the epidemic in my hospital. Let's pay this back. Not a goddamn problem. I'm in great shape financially. I have the staff I need and I'm training the staff I will need. My machines are in decent shape. Look at this. Look at this. They're complaining. Silly bastards. Nurse required in fracture clinic, please. Oh, I can't afford radiators now. Doctor wanted in electrolysis.
Oops. Wrong room. Well, have they been called? Around here, I think. These people are just complaining for the sake of it. For what? For the epidemic? I mean, yeah, it's not your fault, but that's not, you know, that's not the point. As, as far as I've heard, it works the same way in real life. As, lo as long as you can, you also do not declare the epidemic, you attempt to take care of it on your own. And if you do, and if the world gets out, you do kinda take your reputation hit, so it's realistic. Oh, for the machines, of course. Well, they will, they will probably in worse shape than was expected of me. I thought you meant the epidemics. I'm quite upset that I'm wasting the time of this wonderful, brilliant consultant teaching these halfwits. But hey, this guy will be a researcher. Seriously? 53%? That's supposed to be 53%? No, that's just this game. I mean, you know, I appreciate all of it. Let mm. me put it in a, in a different way. I don't appreciate all of it. I appreciate it in its entirety, as a whole. But this stuff, this is just ridiculous. This ball is supposed to represent the progress, isn't it? So why is it supposed to be 53%? What? I mean... As I understand it, it is at 53%, it just isn't showing 53%. This is ridiculous. Doctor needed in Slack Tom Clinic. The VIP gave me $400, that's just pathetic. Uh, but I think I will have to come to terms with the fact that this game has serious flaws. Clinic, and not just in, not just, not in design, because it's designed in a great way, it's just Nurse required in ward. riddled with these silly little bugs that can be so easily taken care of and can be, I mean, they are, they are apparent immediately, you just look at the progress bar and it doesn't fit. Yeah, but I'm guessing that this... Let's take care of this one as well. 6,000 uncommon cold. Uh, no. Nurse required in pharmacy. I have so few patients right now. An enormous hospital and just the just Why? God damn it, get in though. I'm trying to take care of an epidemic. In yeah, she Nurse got in. in. She pharmacy. got out. She got back in. in GP's office. 
Faulty fault percent. And that's 33 percent. Allegedly. Whoops! This guy got infected. And this guy got infected. Why is the nurse out of the garden farmers? No! No, you're doing everyone at the service by. No! God damn. You know what? I just want my staff to listen. I need the nurse in the pharmacy. That's it's as simple as that. If she's not in the pharmacy, she will not be able to treat these people, and the infection will spread further. That's not what I want. Get in there! Sheesh, woman! Get a grip! the guy in the GP office, which is quite unfortunate indeed. This guy's just that well on my consultant. Oh, this guy's a consultant. Morning, earthquake imminent. Yeah, I should probably check the condition of my machine. Even after the earthquake, everything seems to be in tip top shape. Okay, the earthquake did. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. Pretty much nothing. Okay, what was. Warning! Earthquake reported! Yeah, I expected this much. Everything fixed. Everything. And soon. Where's this guy going? Can't we just kill the guy immediately? Where's the psychiatrist? Oh no, this might be the death of me. This guy seriously needs to get himself checked. What if my doctor's become a consultant? A consultant surgeon? Uh huh huh. Yeah, that's not. Well, that's kind of unfortunate. I wanted to train him further, but I guess this is just not gonna work. What about this guy? Oh! He's a researcher and a psychiatrist now. He's just fairly incompetent in all these things. Okay, let's speed this up. I mean, this is horrible and... Doctor Probably ruin me, but whatever. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. Why did you leave? He's on his way to the pharmacy. I mean, can it? Can I make it in time? I think it's over. But if. Just if. Epidemic contained. 
Did they make it in time? Did you see that? That was the final guy. And just before receiving the report, I've managed to kill him. Yeah, exactly. The problem is I'm never sure which one is the correct one. I think the number is, but you never know. Exactly. Doctor required an inflator room. The alleged epidemic that I allegedly had a problem with, allegedly. Just skill mongering from the competition, I guess. I have all the money I could possibly want. Well, alright, not necessarily, but still. I have I have more than zero. Which is still an accomplishment. Forty-eight percent, but you'll never know. Doctor required in GP's office. Hold on. Now this guy can become a surgeon eventually, so I can just put the consultant su surgeon, this guy, over here later, as soon as these people are trained. That will get people competent at all the things. One of my juniors has become a doctor. Let me guess. That's not the guy. Well, is the guy. I guess this is the guy. Doctors. Doctor required in GP's office. Doctor required in X-ray. Well, this is becoming a problem. Oh, this guy's on his way to the staff room because he's so extremely tired. Um, I guess I could use this guy. Yeah. Wow, how did that happen? This is getting ugly. As soon as anyone is free... Two surgeons required in operating theater. Two oh. surgeons required in operating theater. This hasn't happened in a long while. This guy to the operating theater, but I, but I will need a second surgeon as well.
Like guy number six or guy number eight. Oh, guy number eight is currently unoccupied. Let's get crest, buddy. Doctor required in general diagnosis. Well, what? Well, where is the guy? Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. All right. Could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. Doctor required in X-ray. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. Wait, what? What what sort of problem do they have? And well, and with whom? What? 70% um I could just take a chance. At this point I probably should take a chance, but I need the, the additional diagnostics facilities. Ah, uh, the ultra scan. I'm so close to getting the ultra scan, I think. Hmm. Seventy percent chance. Screw it, get him to wait. I'm not losing this guy. <sighs> the research isn't going all that well, especially since no one is researching anything currently, because there are no researchers in the room. But I'll need to fix that. Shortly. Oh, here's one researcher. Okay, this guy is... I should probably take all the researchers I have. This consultant could be of much help around here. Like instead of this guy, for instance. Doctor required in X-ray. Consultant researcher psychiatrist. Ah, no, not the guy. Researcher psychiatrist. Get in here. Let me guess, the progress for my diagnostics equipment research is simply not shown. Doctor required in GP's office. Doctor required in X-ray. Nurse required in ward. Doctor needed in slap tongue clinic. This, this this amazing surge of, of patience. Sheesh. What has happened? That's just 28%. So what the hell is going on? But they are extremely happy, nonetheless. Huh. Do I need more people? Do I really? I mean, I have probably jeopardized my efforts by putting too many people into the research facility. Doctor required an inflator room. So was the ultra scan. Seven people with serious radiation. Let's try to get through this. Might be difficult, but hey. Pissing me off because yeah, one of my doctors has become a consultant. Which one? Two surgeons required in operating theater. Staff announcement: Patients arriving with serious radiation. Doctor required in decontamination.
Don't tell me he became a consultant while resting. That would be ridiculous. Doctor needed in Slack Tom Clinic. Knew I had to. Keep Doctor required in decontamination. God damn it, buddy! Just stay though. Just stay in your room. Don't no, don't, don't leave. Don't don't leave. Doctor required in GP's office. You know what? Screw it. Disallowing leaving rooms. Now he's staying though. And now I need to take care of all the matters manually. It's not making me happy, but hey. Let's see if I can take care of this. Doctor required an inflator room. Doctor required in X-ray. People, I might just be able to make Doctor it. required in GP's office. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Even though I really am running out of time. Nurse required in ward. Yeah, but I still hate the idea of just letting people die and failing an emergency because of that. Doctor I mean, required. Get away around. Fading the emergency and the fall. Letting people die. Two more people, this shouldn't be. A problem. Oh, this is getting tense. One more person. Just one more person, come on. Get in. Raise the edge. Come on. Watch out, we've got a VIP in the building. Yes! Everyone. And now I have almost $50,000 because of that. How crazy is that? I mean, it was a risk. And I didn't even consider the amount of money I would get for the deal, but hey, it was quite lucrative. Here's the ultra scan, finally. How big is the ultra scan room anyway? I think it's 4x4. Four four. Yep, it's 4x4, four four, so I can just... Uh, I really want to move anything. Let's just put the ultra scan somewhere around here.
right. Oh, I need to alter my research priorities now because everything, everything for curing people and everything for diagnosing people has already been re research discovered and pretty much implemented. Oh, not good. I need my consultants to take care of this. Well, are they? Here's one of them, but well, are all the others? Consultant psychiatrist. Well, didn't want to have to resort to this, but I don't have much of a choice. Okay, now this guy should be in the training room, taking care of those in my staff who need the help. Like this guy could be a psychiatrist. To probably keep on moving people in and out of training as they are needed. Doctor wanted in ultra scan. Doctor required in X ray. Doctor wanted in electrolysis. Doctor wanted in electrolysis. Doctor wanted in ultra scan. Doctor needed. Doctor required in X-ray. Doctor required in GP's office. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Doctor, attend in psychiatry, please. <sighs> All the things. went overboard here. And I should probably move this. Because it's blocking the way pretty much everyone involved. It's just horrible because it's right next to the GP office. Academic alert, stand by! Well, let's see how I can handle this. Uncommon cold, yeah, let's let's see. Doctor required 
First place in the Hall of Fame, finally. Highest salary. I'm not the richest. I'm close. Highest skill count. Well, not the lowest death count, unfortunately. Most visitors are still value. Machinery. Once again. Of course, I have shot many rats. Staying alive. I have avoided all the deaths that have been possible. No deaths at all this year. Impeccable standards, highest reputation, clean hospital, amazing cure to death ratio, amazing reputation, so I get all the money. Qualified researcher, that's nice. I should probably get a second pharmacy. Of all the places, a pharmacy is quite needed, especially in an epidemic. And it's cheap to get, so. I really don't have an excuse not to have a second one. There's something over here that I need to pick up, but I don't know what it is and where it is. Come on! <sighs> it's not like I can rotate the map or something. What is it? Come on, just I have to many nurses, perhaps I don't. Nurse required in ward. No, you stay here. This will take care of the epidemic, I think. But yeah, the second pharmacy was a good idea. Just look at the efficiency.
Yeah, the epidemic is over. So this guy is a psychiatrist and a researcher now. I mean, I need to educate this guy further, but I would also like to have more surgeons. And to do that, <laughs> and to accomplish that, I will need uh, handling surgeons around here. Doctor required in general diagnosis. Can lead to horrible consequences. Yeah, many things in this game would be nice. Doctor required in decontamination. Nurse required in fracture clinic, please. Doctor required in general diagnosis. I'm tiring out my surgeons. This is a horrible thing. I cannot take this emergency. I'm glad I paid attention. I cannot, I can absolutely not take this Doctor emergency. Required in X my surgeons are tired as hell. Even though they may not seem tired, they sure as hell are. Now I need to take care of this guy and have him rest a bit before he teaches these guys. On well, this surgeon, he's completely tired. And this guy... Doctor required in blood machine room. Well, this guy's not as competent as the other ones, but he's kind of tired as well. I would not have been able to take care of that emergency. Not at all. I think I do have too many nurses, god damn it. Probably not enough handymen. Because they need to keep repairing all this stuff. Yeah, that's probably the problem. Mm, I have five handy. Four nurses isn't excessive. to go. Fifty seven percent, yeah right. Oh, I have an idea. Take this guy. Come on. Doctor required in GP's office. interesting observation. I guess people nowadays just don't have the patience, do they? <laughs> right. Fantastic. Doctor required in 
GP's office. Doctor, attend immediately in cardio, please. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Doctor required in GP's office. But then again... Are there really no games that actually take you a few hours to beat a level or something? I'm fairly certain certain strategy games absolutely fulfill this criterion. People would complain that the game is too long? Jeez. What a world we live in. Too much entertainment, I cannot possibly handle it. Come on, you can take a break. Not like you are forced to play through all of it at once. this guy not learning. Come on, become a surgeon. Doctor required in blood machine room. Doctor But you have things like open world RPGs which take a long while to beat, so... Oh, sheesh. This guy is absolutely needed here. These queues are getting crazy. I might... I might need to invest in a third GP office, or at the very least, I might need to have two consultants here at all times. Mm -hmm. With a consultant, eh, okay. two surgeons required in operating theatre. Two surgeons required in operating theatre. Doctor, attend in psychiatry, please. Oh, this guy is a consultant. Let's put him over here. Nurse required in pharmacy. Just need a single surgeon. This guy's a consultant surgeon, he can take care of this and then go back to teaching. I'll probably use the different surgeon. Move the researcher, why the hell not? Not much research for me to do. I'm better off just training people to be more competent. There's no one training them though, so that's not helping anyone.
Urgent required in operating theatre. Doctor needed in Slap Tong Clinic. Two surgeons required in operating theatre. Come on, man. Doctor required in decontamination. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. Doctor, attend in psychiatry, please. Nurse required in ward. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Nurse required in pharmacy. Uh, so you're probably referring to the Nurse notion of... Nurse required in pharmacy. God damn it, I could take care of all these things. You're probably referring to the, the concept of instant gratification. And the fact that people expect to be patted on the back constantly. Well, that's... That's not something you can absolutely rule out when it comes to longer games. You just... Keep rewarding people for every single thing they do. Nurse required in ward. I wouldn't see that as an issue. On the contrary, I've heard people complain many a time that the games were too short. So. Doctor required in blood machine room. Doctor required in GP's office. It's a dodgy concept, isn't it? I mean, as long as you're happy playing a given game, you can call it a skin and box or you cannot call it a skin and box. Either way, you're having fun. Because ultimately pretty much anything that feels rewarding can really do that, so... I guess it's a matter, it's a matter of finding things that are rewarding even though they shouldn't be. Which is qu questionable in and of itself. People are so slow to train, sheesh. I have to juggle everyone around the hospital just so I can train these very few people and in the end I probably will just have one by the time I get to benefit in any shape or form from all this effort I have put into it. Might have not as well... I need to help this poor woman or she's gonna die. Two surgeons required in operating theatre. Two 
Just fix Don't all the things. Yeah, let's get one more handyman just just to take care of the machinery because I have a feeling it might be necessary to keep everything in order. Scan diagnostics are too expensive. That's fine. to fix all the things. Let's check my surgeons before this how uh seven people with hariasis. With hariasis. Hmm Try this. I should probably build a second clinic just because it's risky to attempt such a procedure with a single facility. And then I can sell it. The door is supposed to be down here. The machine is supposed to be in this part and it's supposed to be here. Wait. Now I just need two consultants and I'm ready to go. Machines truly need maintenance. In one more earthquake and this will go kaboom. Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. Doctor required in GP's office. Doctor wanted in ultra scan. Staff announcement: patients with hairyitis are on the way. Where did my consultants go? Nobody. 
I know that you are needed elsewhere, but this is an emergency. Thousand bomb. Nice of you to join us. God damn it. This guy gets taken care of before the people. As long as they divide themselves evenly between the facilities, this should not Doctor, be a problem. In the scanner room, please. Of course not, why would they? The bastards, fine, let me divide them manually. Second facility has the additional benefit of putting less Doctor strain. Of putting Doctor less. Actually, yeah, I should probably tone this down a notch because sheesh. The additional benefit of having two facilities. Is that I'm putting a lot less of a strain on my machinery, otherwise I might need to repel in the middle of things, which is never Doctor needed in slap tongue clinic. something you want to have happened. Okay, I think I'm done with the emergency. Doctor, has been taken care of. Ah, now of course my educational efforts have been for naught so far. Probably re replace that because it's cheap and it will not blow up on me in the midst of things after slightest bit of overuse.
I hate doing this, but two consultants are pretty much a must at all times in the GP offices, otherwise this is gonna get out of hand. Because surgeries are ongoing, so I cannot take the consultant surgeon to teach others how to become surgeons. This is just the way it usually is. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Oh, maybe I should get them replaced. Doctor required in X-ray. But hey, if I can keep them from blowing up, I don't think I'm doing something wrong. consultant to take care of the GP office. Let's see if I have anyone else. This guy is tired, unfortunately. This guy is teaching. This guy is the psychiatrist. Nope. Great. This guy's on his way to the GP office. Yeah, that's not the brightest of ideas. This guy's totally incompetent. What I need is for the consultant to finally not be tired. Because he can take care of the GP up as well. Someone teaches these guys more skills. But yeah, this situation is being taken care of. So that's an amazing sign. Okay, let's take this guy away from here and into here. Doctor required in GP's office. Fine, I'll put someone who is not a consultant in, in the GP office just for him to be there. It's better than having an empty GP office because then there's no use. Doctor required in well, hello, finally. You've taken your sweet time to get here. It's nice to, nice to see you, Daifem. Dip him. First place in the Hall of Fame, by the way. I am the richest, pay the highest salaries, have the lowest death counts, highest cure count, most visitors, highest all value. And of course my machines have not been, been taken care of. But People are staying alive, I have the highest reputation, my hospital is clean and safe, I have an amazing, impeccable cure to death ratio, and the highest reputation. So my reputation is currently at 930. People are extremely happy with me. Yeah, I finally keep getting it right. Ah, uh, having a life. I can't imagine what it would be like. Immediately in cardio, 
Should I get another doctor? Ah, oh, sheesh. Exactly, was well, night. Yet another surgery, and so many surgeries are scheduled. Oh boy. Oh, fortunately, this is something I am able to take care of because I have enough nurses. Oh, look, that color doll serves its purpose. Uh, so many people queued up for the scanner and for the psychiatric facility. Ah. Great, so I need to get the consultant to take care of this. Nurse required in fracture clinic, please. Throw out. Announcement. Patients with gut rot arriving. Hold on, emergency. Um, throughout the game all today? Nurse required in pharmacy. Because today, as far as I can tell, absolutely no one. Doctor wanted in ultra scan. I have improved all the things I have. Why are these people... Uh. I am even able to take care of all the people that need medical attention before... Before the people... Uh... That I need to prioritize. Doctor required in GP's office. Oh boy. And of course they spread unevenly. Two people over here, five people over here. Why? Because of the benches? Is that it? Well, that seems accurate. That's 75%, all right? I mean, 73, whatever. Why are these people just wandering around in this narrow corridor? Actually, they are the ones who should be getting the education. They are both researchers and psychiatrists. And they have a consultant surgeon over there. This psychiatrist over here, so he can help people queue up for the cardiogram. By the way, so much happiness. Look at this.
Well, you haven't missed anything. This is not necessarily the most... Doctor required in X-ray. Well, things don't change rapidly in this game. It's a slow and steady flow. Doctors has become a consultant, and I'm not sure whether that's a good thing or a bad thing. Sometimes it can be a bad thing. Can't tell which one, perhaps this one. It's now a... Uh, maybe not. I did manage to set up Tropical for the stream, absolutely. I was just busy last week. Well, this week, actually. Hell, both. Whoa, oh we need to help this woman. Because otherwise she's gonna die. And she's very... She's surprisingly close to death as it is. We need to do something about this. Come on. Get help, otherwise you're gonna die. You're gonna die, woman. Seek medical assistance. Doctor, attend in the scanner room, please. Doctor required in GP's office. Oh no, not why is she queued up to the wrong GP office? Uh, fine. Let's take the surgeon. Take care of her. No, you're the first one in line. Get in there. General practice broken win. General practice broken win. Can you just... Can you just get killed, please? Oh, no, 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 not like this! If the nurse leaves, I... Save her! And why on earth is only a single nurse... ...manning the pharmacy? I have bought enough of them. Well, you're cured, aren't you? Why is the symbol over... Finally. Peace. I should probably get... I should probably get toilets over here or something. So people won't experience this sort of problem. And if I want to get something else, I can always move this. It's really not that big of a deal. More of a benefit than a detriment to anything. There we go, problem solved. Now of course my surgeon is now stuck around here, which is not where I want him to be. The consultant is almost no longer tired. Consultant psychiatrist can go over here. Oh, this guy's a regular consultant, that's interesting. Doctor required in X-ray. I could probably get a second bench here. Ah, here's a regular consultant. I should probably have him replace one of the guys around here. The researcher, for instance. Infectious laughter. This might be difficult to take care of, but I'll Doctor take my chances. Office. 
Oh, there's a cue to the psychiatric room. Great. So I can... Finally. Sheesh. Yeah, I wanted to move all these things. God damn it, I should have moved them. My reputation is sky high. Okay, as long as these people get taken care of, I should be fine. Is it? Is it in a laptop or something? Because otherwise I... Yeah, so conceptually it's simple, but from a practical standpoint... Especially if the case is small, then sometimes fitting new things in can be such a pain. And trying to connect... Oh yeah, a laptop. No, this guy needs to be taken care of! This guy... ...needs to be taken care of immediately, otherwise I'm going to fail! He's the, he's the last one, no! No! Screw you! You're not getting out of there. Ah, oh, sheesh! Come on! I'm running out of time here! Okay, fine. Sheesh. That was a close one. Ten people with slack tongue. Let's do this. Okay, this is going to be tricky. As long as he's not needed, he might as well teach. Thank you. 
Of course, I get the compensation. What about other people? A consultant psychiatrist could be of help. This is gonna be tough. <laughs> I should probably free up these guys because they are needed. And of course, all of them are going to the single facility. I'll have to move everyone else over here. Oh, now they are going. Uh, God damn these people. So this guy is a consultant surgeon, he needs to get back to teaching absolutely no one! Where did the other guys go? They are probably busy- oh. Can I actually train anyone before the level ends? Whoa! That explains the sudden swell. <laughs> um, I might. I haven't decided yet, and I'm not really necessarily looking forward to it all that much, but I might. I consider even beating one of them an accomplishment worth celebrating. Oh boy, I absolutely need more doctors, I guess.
<laughs> a poorly run and badly staffed hospital, huh? I don't think so. Oh my. <sighs> I need to keep putting my... Wait a minute. This guy can be here instead of... Instead of this guy. Instead of that guy. And this guy can take care of something. And the guy who's only a surgeon being trained in something. Oh, this is the guy. Probably get educated. God damn it, once again. Try to take care of this. No, it's fine, it's absolutely fine. We'll get rid of this. With two pharmacies, it shouldn't be. Oh. Nurses actually do things. Have you seen that she actually just just ran up to the guy and and she did something? I guess he, I guess he's no longer contagious now. Look at it! She ran up to her and, and did something to her as well. That's brilliant. 
I wasn't convinced back then, but now I have seen that. They actually do things. So it apparently makes sense to employ a few more nurses. God damn it. Ah, she's tired, of course she is. Machines up. Doctor needed in hair restoration. Two surgeons required in operating theatre. Okay, epidemic taken care of. A few more people and I'm done. Oh no. Oh no, and I lost the blood machine as well. You can't really kill people on purpose in this game. Of all the games. Yeah, he's watering the plants, that's great. And he... Why would you... Doctor required in 
Okay, you know what? I don't have the nerves for this. Not right now. I've been streaming this for over two hours. And it's nearly done, but not quite. No, that's even worse. I actually told him to sweep the floors. So the guy who was told to sweep the floors goes into the room with the malfunctioning machinery to water the plants. Yeah, that's what, why the machinery, after being broken, doesn't really get repelled all that well. It needs to be repelled again quite soon. Either way, 